go right back into another one of Wolf's favorites and another customer pick. And this is a this is actually like the second upgraded version of the pie maker that we did initially. Because when we did it initially, you only could do two. You can now do four, which hence again is what's making this such an incredible value. We sold it at $69.95. It's $39.95. Three flex pay payments as well on this one of only $13.32. But here's the thing about it. With also that non stick interior it's not just for pies but boy does it make the most amazing pies and I love Wolfgang's too Bobby because he doesn't want it to just be about the crust so many of the little pie makers out there you'll see they're really really shallow so it's this mm -hmm. big thing of crust and then almost no filling he wants right. it to be about crispy crust but also um, a really luscious filling and I love too that the crispiness is all over a brown crunchy crust that's perfectly cooked and this is all again from no preheat so you put your pies in because they're really dip deep we do use little aluminum strips if you want it just aids you in getting them out that's a great shot can you we don't shoot have it from to. the uh, from the like sideways so you can actually see how deep because I think that's really important. That is really one of the, look at that. Mm -hmm. I mean, that is honestly one of the most important discerning features and difference, differentiation of our, our wolves versus other ones that are out in the Completely, retail market. Completely, right? And yet it doesn't have to be difficult. We didn't make any of this pie crust ourselves. It's store-bought, I'll show you in a minute. But when you cut it, you've got crispy, crispy crust that's perfectly cooked, and then oh. lots oh of ooey, ooey, gooey filling. So how about a little cherry pie? But that's the mm. dessert. We kind of mm. started backwards, but let me let me show you what I've got up here because pot pie the first thing that everyone makes when they get this at home is chicken or beef pot pie chicken the most because we tend to buy a lot of rotisserie chickens in America mm -hmm. and we have a little bit of leftover mm -hmm. leftover so right. that and a little bit of soup from a can you know the creamy one that we all know and love makes the best chicken pot pie add some frozen mixed vegetables to oh, store-bought crust and can you imagine chicken pot pie for dinner oh cherry God, pie for so dessert good. it's a good day well, ex exactly and that's a cool thing about it and by the way it heats up quickly you also can have as we said the entire meal so when I mean, you can do your whole meal at once you can do your pies and do your dessert or do your pie and come back or I mean to do your like your, your chicken pot pie or meat pie whatever you're gonna do for dinner and then you want a nice piping hot dessert you can do that and make that in a matter of minutes I have to share with everyone we do not have a lot of these to go around so we have fewer than 2,000 for the entire country. Mark today at $39.95. Oh, that looks so good. So yummy, right? And that's just some leftover pot roast. It could mm. be some leftover barbecue. Mm. Frozen mixed it vegetables, put it in the crust. And what I love too, Bobby, is you don't have to be too finicky with how you do this. Because the pie maker crimps and seals everything, mm, you good. just get to lay the ingredients in. And then when you're, um, and I'll show you how to make one real quickly. That's really it's, good. It's really <laughs> easy. <laughs> but you just drop the crust in. It comes with a cutter that cuts the bottom and the top crust, so it's mm -hmm. really easy for you to do. You get to choose the filling. If they're in the case of pie, we just bought these fillings like in the can. They've gotten pretty good. Of course you can make your own. And so this is what it looks like when you cut the, the bottom crust. It notches, the little cutter that comes with it notches it. I'll show you in just a second. But don't worry too much about getting this down in here. Just push it down in like this. See, I'm not really worried about the edges. You'll see in just a minute. I remember too. Just kind of push yeah, it in there. Don't, don't feel like you've got to um, make it just so. Right. And you can actually do this with the machine unplugged, especially if you're doing it with your kids or grandkids, because it doesn't need the preheat time. It's so quick until it's done. And how much better to be able to have a, like, a nice hot meal, yeah. right? You're in control. Yes, exactly. And I love it too because truly, I mean, it's a great way to utilize all of the leftovers. I know one of the things that Wolf's made in here that I love is when he takes old macaroni and cheese Yum. and makes like a little macaroni and cheese pie that is phenomenal. But again, the sky is the limit with what you can make. And I know that there's a clock up on the screen. Uh, may, imagine making like little omelets in the morning or maybe just making little mini lasagnas or maybe little mini meatloaves and all of it at $39.95 so it's breakfast it's lunch 
it snacks, and then the fact that it's lightweight and that it's portable, so you can literally just take it anywhere with you. So again, for people who do have campers and boats and RVs, this is great. You know, and, if, and if there's two of you, you have a delicious hot piping dinner and dessert. Top in a matter of minutes. You do, and without worrying about, oh my gosh, some of the filling went overboard like it did here, or oh, I don't have that crust in just right. Don't worry about it. So the other side of the cutter makes the top, and all you're gonna do is this, boom. And oh, the, the machine's gonna seal it for you. So you just add your little tops, and this does not have to be pie dough. You could use a slice of bread for a lot of this. You can make them open face. We haven't even gotten to the cupcakes, but watch. This is what you do. When you push the lid down, you're gonna close it all the way, and then you're gonna put this little lever down, plug it in, and I mean, you can see this is even plugged in because it takes such a quick amount of time to preheat. Eight minutes later, you come back and your pies are ready. They're pre and in fact, if I open it, you'll see what I mean. See how it already is crimped? Yeah. and then sealed so they are ready to go. I love it too. Like basically you can kind of make every single meal open like faced. a gourmet meal. Oh, so open faced those? pumpkin, pecan, lemon and chocolate tart. And I'll pull out pumpkin and then I want to get to the cupcakes because I don't want oh, you to think that it's just so for pies. Good, but imagine if you're like me and you struggle with your weight, one of the best things you can do is enjoy a lovely treat, but please let it be portion control. I was gonna say, then you're right? not eating the entire if pie, right? If it's right? a huge pie, I'm gonna be going back in there to get seconds and thirds and you know, on and mm. on and on. But pumpkin pie for one or for two, this is big enough to maybe share, oh but how lovely is that? Gosh, that looks amazing. Mm -hmm. and by the way, we have only a little over two minutes left for everyone to jump on in, get it dry. And by the way, when, when you're shopping for our clearance items, don't forget, I mean, you still have the full return policy that goes all the way to the end of January. And then something else I, want, else I additionally wanted to mention is that you spend $75 from anything that you shop from with us now at midnight all the way to midnight tonight and we will ship everything to you for free so it's another we, we love our you know our great clearance events and particularly with the shipping it makes it even more exciting look at this Oh, so if wow. you want to have a really fun That's party fun. with your kids or grandkids, let everyone make their own little cupcake. It's so fun. You, this well, is just from a cake idea. mix. You can color it if you want to. You can make it rainbow. We love this one. It's just a vanilla cake mix and a chocolate, so you can make the little black and white. But you just pour the batter in, plug it in, and about 10 minutes later, you've got the perfect little cupcake that's Delicious. individual. But this one, Bobby, this is breakfast. This breakfast. is our, our kids and grandkids. This mm -hmm. is what they do. Any egg, you're going to be making a lot of this over the next I couple of days. I love it, right? right? So, this one we used egg and a tortilla. Ah. This one we used egg whites. This oh, is for oh, me. That's Marianne. great, too, which is I'm always on a diet. And then you add some veggies to it, right? Mm. This, just a slice of white bread. You'll recognize that, right? Oh, and then you pop yeah. the egg in the center. So that oh, makes a little cool. easy crust. Let's and then this that. one, one of the biscuits that you crack open on the counter, mm -hmm. make a little well in the center, and then fill it with eggs, and we did cheese in that case. Okay, but how so special, easy. how fabulous, and how easy. Right? You're right. And again, when you look, because one, one of the most important things about this, if I turn it to the side, is how deep and thick. The extra deep wells is what really separates this particular pie maker from a lot of pie makers that are out there and again customer pick you can go to our website do so and read the reviews and know that you have the opportunity with anything to be able to get it home and try it here's a piece of cutter mm -hmm. that also comes right along with it as well and it's just store-bought pie dough the kind that comes in little roll-up tubes so the larger one is the bottom and what's so cool Bobby is it just it not only cuts it but it notches it so that it can go down in that deep well yeah. if you flip over the other side it's smaller and that's what makes your little top crust so see one cutter makes both of them bottom top bottom and you know what you think about like the kids you're running out in the morning the kids are running out to school how great to be able to make them and way better for them in terms of energy level to be able to have a great protein breakfast in the morning instead of just like grabbing a, a, a bun of some sort or some kind of a, a, a piece of pastry Marion thank you so thank much you, and Marion's going to be